Welcome to Jim Norton and Sam Roberts. Hey! My wife's vagina smells! <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, it's uh, Bill Clinton and Sam Roberts. <laughs> My wife's got sticky underarms! Bill, we're on the air. <laughs> All she wants to do is lick coder! <laughs> <laughs> what a great story. So much going on this morning. Bob Kelly will be here. There's an awesome Donald Trump clip that we have to play. But yeah, I mean, I thought of you as soon as I read this story. That Bill Clinton's longtime lover, <laughs> which, like, you don't know if it's true. Right. But I don't not believe it. Sure, from the 70s and the 80s. She yeah. Was with them. It's uh, one of Bill Clinton's longtime lovers revealed uh, how Bill bemoaned his sex life with his wife because uh, she had greasy hair, body odor, but she wanted a baby to dispel the rampant lesbian rumors. <laughs> My wife's hair looks like a dish rag. <laughs> the inside of Hillary's panties smell like a carp. <laughs> if you wanted a, if you wanted a baby so badly. So that people would stop calling you a lesbian? <laughs> wouldn't you just wash your fucking hair? <laughs> like, wouldn't there be some kind of art of seduction being done? Yeah, I told her to gargle. Your mouth smells like pussy. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, just wash under your arms. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> you just, and, and, and lesbians, it doesn't mean you don't shower just because you're a lesbian. I mean, women appreciate somebody that smells good as well. Hillary came to me one night. She said, Bill, they're calling me a doc around the office. Come <laughs> in me. <laughs> and his lover's just sitting there like, Bill, that's a lot of information you're unloading on me. <laughs> Is it really that bad? Or <laughs> My wife's scalp smells like the underside of a wig. <laughs> Oh. It says, uh, uh, Bill Clinton is a sex addicted. My <laughs> wife watches Ellen with a zucchini in her vagina. <laughs> you know, if you're a, this says Bill Clinton is a sex addicted, quote, monster. If, if you're a sex addicted monster and your wife's body odor is too bad and hair is too greasy yeah. to have sex with, we're in trouble. Yeah, my wife smelled too bad. I had to go in the kitchen and fuck a tuna sub. <laughs> 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 he said, uh, Bill uh, mocked Hillary Clinton by calling her the warden yeah. in front of his friends and privately boasted about his high notch count, according to his longtime mistress and childhood <laughs> friend, Dolly Kyle. <laughs> Dolly! <laughs> Dolly, get over here and sit on my face. Hillary's pussy smells like a can of sardines. Bill, why don't you just talk to your wife about it? I can't. Her breath smells like pussy. <laughs> She coughed it, got a pubic hair in my face. <laughs> and it wasn't a men's pubic hair. No, it wasn't. No. Um, the 68-year-old woman, Dolly Kyle, uh, says she had a decades-long affair with the former president. Oh, no, that's D. Kyle. That looks like Doc. Oh, no, Hillary. <laughs> <laughs> with the former president before and during his marriage and had a front-row seat to Bill's salacious double life. In the 70s and 80s. Ugh. Oh, Bill had a double life because his did. wife was a stinky lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> Allegedly. <laughs> My wife smells like an asshole and plays for the liberty. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> My wife combs her hair with Crisco. <laughs> <laughs> Their on again, off again relationship ended abruptly in the 1990s after Bill Clinton allegedly threatened to destroy Kyle if she spoke to the media about their relationship. Clinton looks weird when you look at the old pictures of him, like in the 70s, he had that full head of hair, black. He looks weird with jet black hair. Yeah, he does. Like, go down and go out and go, keep going. The one, none of the ones we just saw, Adrian. Uh, he, looks more, like, he looks like a young black man, right? <laughs> no, just, not at all. <laughs> yes, he's a young African American. <laughs> yeah. Uh, right there. He's had jet black Weird. It looked weird on him. It's weird for both of them. Looking at Hillary and Bill Young, yeah. because they've become such uh, political monsters yeah. that the idea that they were ever like young human beings 
is alarming. I'm looking at a young photo of Hillary Clinton, though. I could see her having stinky pits. Absolutely. You know, I could see her putting that backpack on, yeah. going for a sweaty walk, and maybe not applying uh, antiperspirant properly. Yeah, she spends all day lawyer and then gets in the bed, smells like a homeless person. <laughs> yeah, she's sitting there with her with her sport coat on, <laughs> arguing in a court of law. Yeah. You know, her hands are moving all over the place, and she's getting all passionate about trying to get somebody off. But what happens? She gets all sweaty and she doesn't yeah. like deodorant. I raped a girl. She got her off and she put her dirty pussy on my face. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Dolly. <laughs> uh, Dolly said that the Clintons' uh, attacks on her reputation <laughs> and alleged attacks on other women who had relationships with or were assaulted by Bill Clinton uh, show that Hillary Clinton is not a supporter of women or sexual uh, of, of sexual violence. Yeah, <laughs> she's not a supporter of sexual violence. I, she's not a supporter of women who are victims of sexual violence. Yeah. yeah, I would say if if Hillary is trying to silence a woman who was abused because she doesn't want her coming out uh, about being a lesbian with greasy hair. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that's, that's probably a bit selfish. Yeah, it really is. <laughs> <laughs> My wife's hair smells like a foot and looks like wet spaghetti. <laughs> oh, is that the worst thing? Greasy hair on a woman? <laughs> oh, greasy hair. It, it just means you don't want. Gosh. Stinks. Greasy hair. Stinks. Hillary used to just slick her hair back, but there was no product in it. No. It's just, just grease. Natural. Bo- Bill, your body is built to clean itself. Oh, that's what she would say, <laughs> yeah. too. Well, your body, the vagina is like a self cleaning oven. She learned all her, all her cleaning tips from her lesbian friends. <laughs> <laughs> Hillary would just be like, no, you know, Laura was telling me that you don't actually, it's actually bad for your scalp. To shampoo once a week. I don't do it that often. You don't need to clean it for him. <laughs> That's Let it. him enjoy the way you are. Yeah. It's not his story. It's her story. And your story <laughs> is about having hair the way God put it on your head. There's a lot of the women that like that. They're the hippie mentality. They think that it's going to self-clean in the body. You don't shouldn't shower too much. It doesn't stinky pits. That wouldn't bother me. That bothers him. Though. The body does not self-clean. If, if a woman, I get it having a little bit of an aroma, but you're saying if she had legit stinky pits, like this is a woman with body odor, it doesn't bother you? Uh, it depends on what the body chemistry is. Sometimes it really turns me on. Really? Like yeah. like bad, like this stinks, yeah. like body odor. Yeah. I used to let my make my ex high body, but my ex girlfriend used to tell her, don't put deodorant on uh-huh. until she stunk. And we were walking in a restaurant and people were turning and looking at her. She smelled so bad. Oof. I was so happy. And you liked it. Went crazy. That was your little turn on. Yeah, made me nuts. Robert Kelly. Yeah. I'm an official. I'm an official <laughs> guest. I saw you showing the pass. I'm just letting you know in case you were like, "Why?" Well, I, I walked in because I have the pass. You got the pass. Yes, you do, dude. It's so funny. You're talking about stinking. Yeah. I hate that. You don't like it, but yeah. you love it. I do. I'm the right person. The chemistry is good. I enjoy what, it. What does that mean? Sometimes body chemistry is weird. It's like when you kiss somebody, sometimes their mouth tastes weird. Like if you have good body chemistry with somebody, I like that sem- that smell. So it's just, is it because everybody has a different smell, or it just hits you different? My wife's pussy smells like Bob's omelet. <laughs> <laughs> There's a story about one of uh, Bill Clinton's ex-lovers, yeah. you know, from the 70s and 80s, yeah. and she's coming forward and saying that Bill used to always complain to her because Hillary had body odor and greasy hair, it but she lesbian. wanted, <laughs> yeah, but she wanted to get knocked up because she wanted people to stop calling her a lesbian. But Bill didn't want to have sex with her because she stunk and had greasy hair. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah. It was like fuck. In a Reuben. <laughs> <laughs> I like Rubens, but if a girl smelled like one, I wouldn't like it. And that's so good, good right? Yeah. Rubens is one of my favorite things it in the world. <laughs> but if a girl smelled like one, I'd throw up. You love Rubens, but would you want to impregnate one? I don't think so. Probably no. not. I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't want to eat an ass that smelled like birthday cake. Like great food does not love translate. No, I would, I would like it to be a little human. I'm not a food guy. I don't like food and sex either. That makes me puke. Like nine and a half weeks when they fucked by the fridge yeah, like and they that. poured all that stuff. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. That's right. Did they pour food on each other? Yeah, yeah they had all yeah. kinds of whipped cream and I hate chocolate that. sauce. It's like does ugh. nothing for me. Me neither. Chocolate just, sauce near a twat looks like shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just a sticky yeah, she mess. Shit, a bad taco. <laughs> <laughs> just fucking yuck. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I don't like food. I don't want any whipped cream on the nipple. No. No, no because the... the uh... You didn't see that Varsity Blues scene? Isn't that the movie Varsity Blues when I think Allie Larder, maybe, came out wearing a, a whipped cream bikini? And everybody went nuts for her. Yes. Oh my God, so sexy. That's yeah. like, all you gotta do to get her naked is throw water on her. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> fucking bikini disappears like the witch. 
Yeah, and then you, it goes down into her, her vagina and then her butt juice mix. Yeah. And now it's some sweet, tangy, Ugh. tangy, metallic -y. That's kind of sexy, though, because she's pretty naked under that. That's sexy because it's it's just hide. It's the only thing between you and her tits is whipped cream. But you're right, though. You go down on her, and if, even if you catch like a hint of whipped cream down there, you're like, ugh, this is leftovers from you, before. You'd think I'd love that. Yeah, no, like that would be my thing. But no, you have separate food, interests. Food. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I compartmentalize. Right, you, there's a spot for food and a spot oh, for sex. Is that Hillary? Yeah, yeah. that's that, she that's all. That bad. Right. What? She looked that bad back then. Her hair does not look greasy. It looks dried out in that photo, but it doesn't look greasy. Yeah, it looks very dry. It looks very dry. It's like a Halloween wig. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it does. <laughs> it looks very dry, but it doesn't look greasy. But this is a very young photo of her. Yeah. This is when she was in college. And and I could definitely... She's wearing, like, pants and a smart shirt. I could see her having stinky pits in that photo. She's probably good in bed, though. I bet Hillary's good in bed. Well, if you're a girl. No, nah, I mean, she's probably bisexual. <laughs> she, if you're not a scissor. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I bet she brought home some girls for Bill. You think they ever had a threesome? No. I bet they no, did. Cause, cause oh, my you, God, you, yeah. Bill would be full... All you see is Hillary getting whopped off the bed, <laughs> just, fall, just right. being pushed off by Bill's ass. I bet when they were younger, they did. And then they tried to do it once when they were older. <laughs> But they started having second thoughts, and they had the third person killed. Yeah, the, other, <laughs> you know, like, the other girl was like, what, what's that mothball smell? <laughs> oh, that's my my chick's pussy. Yeah. <laughs> I dreamt that I was in a garbage dump, and Hillary had turned the fan on. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your Bill impression? It's not good. I like it. I like it not good. But he probably liked it back then. Like, he probably, when he was young, he probably didn't mind that Hillary stunk. She was like a hippie. But when he got older, and he got a little power, because you get the power, you get the women. Well, yeah. that happens with fame, too. I mean, a lot of guys, uh, before they're famous, they're a little nerdy. They're banging, like, theater chicks. Yeah. And, like, dumpy girls. And then they get this fame, and all of a sudden, they're banging 11s. Right. Once you realize you can get a sweet-smelling yeah. Dolly Kyle. Dolly's mm. the one that came out. That's in... probably... She was probably a dish back in 1974, though. Look at her. She was... Yeah, Yeah, wow. she was fucking hot. Dolly Kyle, that blabbermouth. <laughs> <laughs> she asked about Hillary. I said... Oh, shit. This bitch got a dick. <laughs> <laughs> can you, can you side-by-side side those girls? What, Dolly Kyle and young Hillary Clinton? <laughs> yeah. Can you uh, that's not that. kind. <laughs> Why? I was just wondering, you know, you can, you know... Some, just to see where you, you measure know, up. Sometimes like... you feel like a nut. Sometimes yeah. you don't. Right, right. <laughs> My wife smells like Usain Bolt. <laughs> <laughs> uh, she looks like Foghorn Leghorn's <laughs> nephew. I can't keep an erection. <laughs> yeah, but Bill, can I just say something? Bill, okay. Bill didn't deserve the chick on the left, whatever her name is. No. He, he didn't just He wasn't that good looking either. He was an ugly, he was Hillary's, they, yeah, they kind of should go together. He's a very charming dude. He can talk, you know. He can take that that that, that uh, Little Rock, Arkansas used car salesman thing going for him. I, I yeah. I, I and in Little Rock, as soon as he started getting political power, he started to become a dude, yeah, guy. You know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, but he okay, yeah, exactly. But he doesn't deserve her physically. <laughs> right? No, no, no. He had to do a yeah. lot extra. Yeah, if he worked wow. at you know a, you know uh, helping children. Right. <laughs> you Forget know, about the YMCA. It. Forget about it. Making macaroni vases. Someone with just with tweeted kids. a photo of them when they were younger. It's uh. weird to see them together like that. Bill with a beard. You know, a few pounds overweight. Yeah, with two beards. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because when you actually see them they together. Could be, they could literally both be the president. Like, you could literally be standing with two presidents of the United States. It's yeah. bizarre. Yeah, it's but bizarre. They look like that, too. So. When you see them young, also. Yeah. Like, because you know for years. They've been planning some kind of the, the, this political takeover. They've had political aspirations yeah. for a very long time. Uh -huh. When you see them young, it's like you wonder at what point did they become fucking Claire and Frank Underwood. You know what I mean? <laughs> like when you see them, they're just kids. They might have actually been in love at some point. I'm sure they were in love there. Bill's all apple cheeked. He's probably in his Bill face. Was, Bill was fucking yeah. at that point, though. He's fucking other chicks at that. You could tell in his face. Yeah, 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 right now he's got his head leaned back because <laughs> his fucking wife's pit odor is wafting up at him. Yeah. <laughs> Bill is happy in that photo because he's getting laid that night. I'd like to eat apple pie out of Melania Trump's vagina. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. but look at the clothes Hillary wore. That's why she stunk. She yeah. was literally wearing curtains. <laughs> 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 My wife's dressed like a couch. <laughs> 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 you think Bill would complain that uh, Hillary's pits wouldn't stink as bad if she wasn't wearing upholstery? Yeah. Her, fu <laughs> her fucking dress is a Scotch guarded. <laughs> yeah, uh, she looks good right there. 
Yeah, is she that does. Hillary? Stop buying your clothes at Huffman Coos. <laughs> <laughs> Huffman Coos. <laughs> <laughs> You think Bill has made any what inappropriate great... comments about Melania Trump during this election oh, cycle? Oh, has he? When he shook her hand, he was probably like, let's just ditch these two zeros. <laughs> yeah. I'm kidding, but I'm not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Your husband's fat. Your husband's fat. My wife's pussy smells like Staten Island. <laughs> oh, that's a fucking hilarious story. <laughs> she goes, uh... uh it says the two became good friends and dated casually through high school wow. and later began a sexual affair in 1974 oh, after Dolly. Kyle and her first husband divorced. This oh, is Dolly Kyle. He, he met Hillary at, uh, at, at, at college, right? In college, okay. yeah. She's, I mean, she's Dolly smoking. Dolly was smoking back then. I mean, she is really hot. <laughs> oh, Dolly Kyle is throwing her under the bus. Let me tell she you something. She still looks good. Yeah. You know, but Dolly Kyle thought she was going to end up with Bill. That's why. She's got venom in her. Listen to this quote. Dolly, now... Years later, this is from the 70s, as a, as a woman in her 60s, she goes to whatever this was, the Daily Mail, and she says she was shocked by Hillary's unkempt appearance, poor hygiene, poor hygiene, and matronly clothes, and didn't believe it was the same girl that Bill had moved in with. Matronly. Yep. Matronly, matronly clothes. clothes. She's a terrible dresser. And bad hygiene. Hillary is a terrible <laughs> dresser. It's really bad when they say you have bad hygiene, because then it's like... You're just not accomplishing a life skill. No. You know what I mean? Like you don't have the ability. You don't wash. Yeah. You know, you have poor hygiene. That's My your... wife's gums smell like dried sweat. <laughs> you know, she stunk. I've said this before, but the older women get, they, they start to dress like starship commanders. <laughs> yeah, with the jacket on, yeah, with, the, they, they with look, the things. Yeah, they all look like <laughs> Captain Kirk. <laughs> with the, they all have smart jackets yeah. with the shoulder buttons they on them. Shoulder pads and like, yeah. you know, f fucking some type of... Uh, some type of medal they won yeah, that they yeah. didn't win. Pantsuits do. They look like women's pantsuits oh. look like futuristic men's suits. Yeah, H Hillary is the worst with that, though. Her outfits are because it's all the same color from head to toe. <laughs> Dolly, yes. keep it down. My wife's home. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. so fucking mean. Hillary's a bit monochromatic. Ah, <laughs> uh, she really is monochromatic. Good word. Look at the look at the what? Whoa. Whoa, hey, Jim, hey, you're getting Jim. carried away with your Jim. with your soundboard. Jimmy. Jimmy. Hey, so I broke something. If I we can't trust happened. you with the gadgets, we won't give them to you. Hey. <laughs> Mars is getting upset with happened. you over there. I broke something. I, I love when something happened. goes wrong. And Mars gives this look like, "What that fucking idiot do this time?" No, Mars, <laughs> Mars is like, "That sounds bad. I hope I can fix it." <laughs> what happened? I broke something. This is uh uh uh, Dolly Kyle says she picked up. Uh, I picked up Billy at the airport. This is just she calls him Billy now, oh. just to ever just to really drive the point home yeah. of how familiar they were. You know uh -huh. what I mean? She says I picked Billy up at the airport and he had this uh, <laughs> dotty looking middle aged woman with him. This oh woman god. was Hillary. <laughs> oh my god! She's just trashing Hillary. And Bill was shocked when she. I can't believe my wife took a shower. <laughs> Where did cheese go? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> um, Those, uh, she's a, the worst dresser. She yeah. goes, uh, uh, she I thought was, it was a... Uh, <laughs> she I, should be in Guardians of the Galaxy. <laughs> that coat sucks. <laughs> With that long coat that Did goes it, past her knees. did Joseph wear that coat? It really is. It's a Technicolor dream coat, <laughs> isn't it? <laughs> oh, that's funny. <laughs> <laughs> it really is. Nobody should wear coats, male or female, that go past your knees. <laughs> well, if you're in a band. Yeah, if you're in a yeah. band, yeah, right. If you're in a band, you can wear that shit, but if you're yeah. not, you can't If wear you're it. in a band or if you're going to shoot up a high school in Colorado. <laughs> 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 that coat is garbage. Damn. Damn. <laughs> that bitch's jacket looks like she's wearing rugs and shit. <laughs> so Bob made the curtain I thing and hate <laughs> <laughs> chip. Dolly says, uh, I thought it was a Hillary impersonator because she looked so bad and she smelled so bad. She I like just Paul didn't Williams. think it was Hillary. <laughs> <laughs> Hillary looks like Paul Williams. <laughs> 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 With the glasses? Oh, no. Oh, yeah. She that. really does. She looks like he's in camouflage. Her shirts <laughs> look like smocks. Yeah, they're not good. It, yeah. Well, I mean, what are you going to do? I mean, you can't. You got to. You could do better than Hillary's doing. 
Especially I, if she stinks, which yeah. we're finding out today in the news. Uh, apparently, she reportedly does stink. Yeah. Today, still. I believe so. No, is that real? Are people saying that she smells? Dolly, yes, he said that. Dolly Kyle right now is just speaking to her time and saying she she was a woman who couldn't dress and smelled bad. That, that, <laughs> yeah. look, I, probably back then, but not. There's no way. There's no way she smells now. And in the middle, when she was the first lady, yeah. they actually made her, she actually started looking a lot better. They she took did. her glasses off, her hair was done. It wasn't that hay hair. Right. She actually looked all right when she was the first lady. She wasn't that bad. Yeah, she was um no, she's she not bad. Like right there to the left. He Bill actually made he went to the lady and goes, Make this bitch look like somebody yeah. I'd fuck. <laughs> <laughs> She's embarrassing me. People Honestly, ask me to introduce she, him to my mama. I gotta tell you something. What? He styled her to look a, a look a little more like Dolly Cotton. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm saying. He yeah. lo- he looks Look at that. He he gave he gave yeah. Hillary he the said, Dolly make, haircut. He, made, he gave her a picture of Dolly and said, make her look like this. <laughs> make her look like Dolly and make her smell like this, too. Oh, yeah. <laughs> she stinks. <Yeah. laughs> My wife smells like manure. <laughs> you, 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 you think Hillary had a, didn't wash her vagina? Oh, it was probably awful. <laughs> <laughs> when she pulls off her panties, it sounds like a fruit roll-up. <laughs> you think she smells like a jet blue sandwich? <laughs> 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 it's been pre-made and just yeah. sitting in a drawer for two days. Just those purple onions. <laughs> she smells like purple onions. <laughs> <laughs> oh. No, no. Oh, man. Poor Hillary. I know. She can't get a break, huh? What are you talking about? She's almost president. Yeah. But she's still, I mean, she doesn't need people coming out and saying she's yeah. a bad. And this woman's also saying, Dolly's saying she was a sex addict and so was Bill. Like, Dolly was a sex addict. Hillary oh. was not. Hillary was, she said, she doesn't know if Hillary was a lesbian, but she knows that Hillary wanted a kid. And that's another thing. Like, if you're Chelsea Clinton, do you want to read an article that's like, oh, they decided to have me so that nobody would think my mom was a lesbian? Do you think, do you think, <laughs> che- you think Chelsea and Hillary had to talk about it? They probably don't pay attention. But you know, there's that one moment where Chelsea's like, did she really just... Right. Get right, dumped yeah. in her so people wouldn't... Hillary's like, oh, another one of these bullshit articles, right, Chelsea? And Chelsea's like, yeah... Just looking at her mother, like, there's too many of these to not be true. How yeah. funny if it would be. Plus, no, you did how, stink when I was a little girl. That's true, yeah. <laughs> None of the kids would have parties at our house. Yeah. Because you smelled like a diner. <laughs> yeah, you, you always smelled. You always smelled to, like a dish. <laughs> used to chuck deodorants at me in school and said, these are for your mom. My wife's vagina smells like linoleum after you've cleaned vomit off it. <laughs> you know that smell that lasts? You clean linoleum? <laughs> no, you know that puke smell that lingers? Oh. Hey, uh, what if none of it's true? Yeah. That she did, never stunk at she all. She never stunk. They were in love from the beginning. Right. He, he banged one chick by, you know, and got caught and... The Hillary and they had the best family life. She was great in bed. They fucked all the time. Right. And n- none of it's true. There's, yeah. I think that there's very little chance of that happening because the one confirmed case is him shoving a cigar up an intern's pussy. Yeah. You don't start with that. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> you I didn't know what that cigar was, by the yeah. way. You don't, you don't start using a cunt like a humidor. <laughs> 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 That's after 30 That's... years of extramarital frolicking. <laughs> he's, dip- he's dipping in her fucking cunt like a bourbon. <laughs> Yo, <boys>. By the way, <laughs> we were talking yesterday about wanting to get a billboard for this show. I think that needs to be our tagline. Yeah. Yeah. You don't start by using a cunt like a humidor. <laughs> <laughs> My God. Yeah, no, I don't. I think that Bill. Uh, Why would he stick a cigar in a fucking woman's vagina? I get it. He's the president, and he's done it all. He's just being dirty. I want to taste this later. I bet it was. It made it dirtier because it's illegal? Oh, yeah. He's like, you know, I'm not even supposed to have these. (laughs) And then right up her twat it went. (laughs) Hide this. (laughs) Yeah. That was the role-playing game that they went. (laughs) That the police were coming in, and Bill was like, where am I going to hide the cigar? It was lit. Couldn't find his hashtag. I gotta go out there. Yasser Arafat's waiting for me. <laughs> I'll bet he just did that so he could think of it when he smoked. When he smoked it in front of his wife or in front of his friend, he could think of her. He probably he he probably dipped the 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 lit side so when he smoked it, it sm- he tasted her pussy. <laughs> oh yeah. You think mm. that you think that yeah. uh, uh, he would smoke the cigars yeah. with Monica in the room in front of his wife, uh, and then that way him and Monica would know. You know, yeah, this Hillary didn't here. smell it. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I don't know. Hillary may have a sixth sense for that type of stuff. <laughs> God damn it, Hillary keeps eating my cigars. <laughs> <laughs> he just... <laughs> Hillary looks like a bad dog. He walks into the room like, what happened to the cigars? And Hillary just has cigar debris all over yeah. her chin going, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, I heard a clunk and I caught a root and threw the humidor. <laughs> <laughs> Hillary said I'd get blowjobs as long as I dip cigars in pussy. Yeah. <laughs> That's her favorite treat. <laughs> For a birthday, I just put a candle in a cigar. <laughs> he just he just had to keep fixing her cigars for her. <laughs> and you wouldn't even smell the vagina on the cigar. No, but you'd know. Oh, some of them you would. You'd mm. know. You know what I mean? I'm sure yeah. it's just a psychological thing. I think you'd smell Monica's. You think so? <laughs> yeah, she was, a, she was a kind of big girl. She was a chubby girl, for a sure. chubby girl. Probably she, hot. She was thick. She's probably hot. It was, depends on what time of day it was. Oh, yeah. Did she just get to the office? Did she take the train? Oh, no. She so. did, it would have been a, 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 an evening after a day of wearing a wool dress. Oh. You know? Oh, wow. You yeah. Were pants. Yeah, you smelled that. Yeah. 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 No, I think it was. I think there was there was something psychological about him smoking the cigar while Hillary was in the room and Monica was in there too. Wow, she looks good now, Monica, huh? Yeah, she looks good. I mean, back then she was. Uh, so right. She looked no. like no. She looked like Bill's type. She was like yeah. she was like kind yeah. of a wow, chubby, a little trashy bangs. You know what I mean? She looks good, really good now. Yeah, she does look good now. Is she married? Imagine that. Oh fuck! Well, that'd be a tough one to get over. Try to get a blow. No, I'd love it. She try to get a blowjob. You're come on. Be great. You, like to do, you, know. you think it'd be tough to get over? <clears throat> if it was like, your wife? Yeah. Yeah, and your Costco and every old lady uh, keeps looking that's... at your wife and kid. <laughs> well, you look familiar. Yeah. You have to lie. Oh. I'd be fine with it on a <laughs> really? personal level. Really? But not you're right. The public thing of people coming up to you and be like, Oh, your wife's the one that blew. Yeah. Oh, shit. Yeah, sh she'd have to get shirts that say, I suck the president's dick. Yeah. <laughs> right, just to get it just out of the to, way. Just to get in, just to be in on it. Right, just so just so this is on the table. That fat Linda Tripp ruined everything. Yeah, she did. Bill was having a hell of a time. What does she look like now? Linda Tripp? Well, I, I, I hope her hotness held up. <laughs> I do, too, because she was really cute. Yeah, she was really cute. Back then. Oh my God, she doesn't look bad. She actually looks a lot. She better. got her shit together. She's got a lot. She was wow. such oh a God. monster. Look at her up there. She looks like she Laverne. looks like Howard Stern. Oh yeah, she does. She looks like fucking Laverne. Yeah. Do you think she was flattered that SNL? Remember when SNL used to do parodies of her? Do you remember who played her? John Goodman. <laughs> you, think, you think she was flattered that John? They picked John Goodman to play her. <laughs> but if you look at that photo on the right, I mean, it looks like John Goodman. Yeah, John Goodman would be a good pick. I mean, look at that photo. She looks Jesus. much better. She's hiding the neck with that thing she wears. Well, she had a ton of plastic surgery. She looks like fucking uh, Charlotte Nash <laughs> after the chimp attack when she got all put together. Look at John Goodman. <laughs> you, you, I'll tell you exactly too. Lorne Michaels is responsible for that woman having all that plastic surgery. A hundred percent. John John Goodman makes her look really fat and ugly. <laughs> you think so? Yeah. <laughs> John Goodman. Yeah, he, they look so. Can you imagine I mean, being a lady, but, being a woman, being born female? You're a woman. Uh, you have a femininity about you, and you're like, uh, oh, I guess SNL is going to skewer me this week. I wonder who they're going to pick to play me. Maybe, uh -huh. and you turn it on. And it's not any of the A-list actresses. Yeah. It's John Goodman. If you're, if you're a man, that's insulting. Could, yeah. you, could you be imagine? Could you imagine being her friends having to lie? You don't look like John Goodman. You know they're the, out of line. The thing about the, the thing yeah. about the John Goodman pick is. It's not even funny. It doesn't look like you, so it's not funny. Not at all. More like Gerard Depardieu. <laughs> <laughs> you lying piece of shit. All yeah. our friends stink. <laughs> but when she's not around, they're all laughing at it. Uh, they're all having the time of their lives. It says uh, Bill Klepp kept... It's a, a Gurkha cigars. Do you know Gurkha cigars, I Bobby? I do. They're very nice. Are they? Very nice cigar, yeah. I he, mean... He kept uh, uh, several inside sources have confirmed that the Gurkha cigars uh, were indeed the cigars used mm. between Monica Lewinsky That's and funny. Bill Clinton. I would have used the Grand Cajone Tatuaje. Is that right? Job isn't the problem. Very big one. I call it the Wesley Snipes <laughs> <laughs> when I put it in my mouth. Is that what you yeah, fantasize cause it, about? Because it actually changed, the, the end of it uh, goes from ashy to nice dark black <laughs> when you put it in your mouth. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Jim knows. Yeah. I don't smoke cigars. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Don't well, in, in a way. <laughs> oh. Got weird quick, though. <laughs> got, got, got very real, very yeah, fast. Uh, why, would, why would Monica tell anyone that he put the cigar in her pussy? Bill Clinton didn't offer that up. They think I did not have sexual relations with that woman. 
I did put a cigar in your pussy. Yeah. Is that cheating? That's not technically sex. He didn't say that. So no. why would she have said that? She thought this is Monica had <laughs> her own Linda. problem. She thought she was having girl talk with Linda Tripp. And she recorded it. And she recorded oh, it on right. her little she flower was... lapel. Is that it? Yeah. Yeah. That's what SNL as, as would have John Goodman as Linda Tripp it's and just like sitting ever. basically on top of her going like, what was that, Monica? And just pointing the, the brooch yeah. right at her face. Linda Tripp is gross. Yeah. Yeah, but she recorded her telling the story. She thought she was just uh, confiding in Linda Tripp. But why would Linda Tripp know that she was going to tell her something? And how, why would she have I mean, She had obviously talked to her before. Yeah. So she talked to her before and then figured, I'm going to get this on tape. Well, yeah, because Linda had a, a bone to pick with Bill. And where do you get a flower lapel microphone? The spy store. I mean, because back, back then, <laughs> the, now it's so easy. You just have everything has a phone. You can do it. But back then, it was pretty hard. But it, in the 90s, they had like... <laughs> Brick and mortar spy stores. Oh yeah, like you could go into the spy store that was on the corner. You know, none of the shit. The shit worked once. It was terrible. Yeah. The old, the old uh, pen uh, recorder. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, what's look, that? What'd you say? Yeah, but, yeah, 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 <laughs> click. yeah, but the pen was huge. It looked like it didn't look like any pen <laughs> that existed had, at all. You had to hold on your shoulder like a camera. <laughs> <laughs> Plus, there was like w one sentence worth of ink in it because it had to be full of electronics, so nobody could borrow it. Like it was, it was, it was the most suspicious pen <laughs> yeah, yeah. of all. There's no branding on it anywhere. You couldn't hear anything, and then you had no idea how to get the audio off of it. Yeah, it sounded like oh, what? <laughs> Yeah, I but that's... the president's clock and put a scum in my pussy. <laughs> I say that again. Put a scum in my pussy. Well, it's hard to tell from the recording, but she's saying that the president <laughs> shoved a cigar in her pussy. <laughs> uh, yeah, but she obviously had a major bone to pick because she went right. to all the trouble of recording that conversation. Who did she tell it to? I don't remember. Who? Who, who did she go to with Linda that Linda Tripp? Yeah. I don't know. I think she might have gone to the press with it first. She just immediately went to the press. I think that was the plan from I the beginning. I love that it backfired, though, and everybody hated her. Oh, she was Everyone awful. Everyone hated Linda Tripp for that. I right. Know, it was more because she recorded, because Monica was a young, dumb intern, and yeah. she recorded her. And at least you could be like, well, you know, Monica was doing what Monica was doing, whatever. But Linda Tripp was the one person who was being absolutely malicious about the whole thing. She went to the news. She went to the news, right? Yeah, she went immediately to the press how, with it. How much money did she make? Did she make anything? I'm sure she didn't make enough that's, that's, that's maintained oh, she it She gave all. the uh, tapes to Kenneth Starr in exchange for immunity. Oh, okay. But why would you need to have immunity? I don't know. From what? If you didn't tell anybody anything, why? What, what has anyone heard, heard Has anyone heard those tapes? Um, I, I don't remember if they've been heard. I don't remember if just... they were played or not. Hmm. But I know the information got out there. <laughs> the information got out there quickly. Well, that's why it's weird. Everybody's... Attacking Trump that he's a sexual piece of shit and he's done all this stuff, which I don't know if he's done It's alleged right, you know, of course, and if he's done it, he's a, he is a piece of shit But you know Bill Clinton did some pretty awful shit to women, too. Yeah. Well, yeah, I mean, I mean, you, I mean that's also a, alleged like well, maybe maybe no, that's, on, maybe that's not is. alleged Yeah, but he she said is. like go ahead put a cigar in my <laughs> pussy. You know what I mean? If somebody's giving you permission, he didn't rape her with a cigar. No. Well, well, yeah, I, well, he's not. I'm, well, he they, there's alleged stuff for him too. Yeah, that, yeah. he would I rape mean, he with Benson a, and Hedges. <laughs> 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 but like I mean, all the all the stuff that's confirmed about Bill is, but he's at not, least consensual. But you're right, he's not a great. Yeah, but you did it. You stuck us. All right, when you're teaching kids, you kids something. Yeah. <laughs> you know, being the uh, the leader of the free world, <laughs> sticking cigars in interns' pussies. You're saying he may have taken advantage of a power position. Uh, he might have. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know if that's... Could have. You know. He might have <laughs> taken advantage of a young yeah. person that could have a reason to look up to him, you're saying. Yeah, yeah Maybe. exactly. Maybe exactly. there's something to yeah, that's that. Like a chubby, basically... It's like a chubby comic mm. having a good mm. set and getting a hand job somewhere. You know what I mean? From a hot chick. Right. Yeah, taking advantage. <laughs> it's literally what all of us would have done. Of her done. mood. Yeah. I don't know if I would have shoved a cigar in an intern. No, uh, not a cigar. No, no. But I mean, fooled around with her. I don't know if you would have. Monica would have milked your dick so well. You Jesus. think so? Ah. You think so? And nursed it. It does sound tempting. Yeah. Yeah. Good girl. Especially, you're saying any of us would have done that if we were given that position and we had wives that had bad body odor, greasy hair, and Possibly vaginas that stunk. Yeah, and and didn't want to have sex with us. Yeah, but you're talking about us. He 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 admitted to being a sex addict, didn't he? No. Are you no, sure? No, he didn't. Dolly Dolly said he was. Dolly did. Yeah. Uh, uh, Dolly well, Kyle said he was a sex addict. 
But you're sex saying, and she also said that she knocked out Jesse Ventura. I mean, you know. That wasn't Dolly. That oh, was wrong Kyle. Was Chris, Chris Kyle. That's different. <laughs> yeah, but you're saying, you think you think the greatest sniper in the history of the country was also having sex with Bill Clinton? Yes, he was a master of disguise. <laughs> you're saying any of us would do the same thing. That's not really, I mean, in this room, that's not saying much. Right. You know I mean? You're talking about guys who are supposed to be better. They're supposed to be better than us. You're the president of the fucking, right. of the free world. You're supposed to be... A little better than three shitheads in a fucking. Studio. Any of us would do the same thing, which is why none of us would yeah. ever be yeah, even close to elected to do when president. Fucking Monica's bent over the, the 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 table with her asshole out, just yelling. Come and get it. <laughs> <laughs> you really think so? Yeah. That's it. These are some of the best sound bites ever. By the way, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Uh, well, I mean. He, the Donald Trump stuff is just getting creepier. There's a, you know, yeah, because yeah. he's done so much media, everything he's ever done is slowly but surely yeah. coming out. Coming that's out what, to I, haunt him. Yeah. That's what Howard was talking about when he ran for governor. Yeah. And then he started to win. Yeah. He was like, I'm out. <laughs> right. <laughs> I'm fucking gone. Stop looking. Because I'm out. Because <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. And, and, and there, someone said that this same thing might have happened to him where he was like, oh, I'll just run for president. And then he started winning and he's like, what the fuck? But his ego... Won't let him drop out. I, yeah, he should have got the fuck out. Yeah, I don't think that he thought he was going to win this thing. Yeah, or you couldn't have. Like, I think he just went forward being like, this will be great. I'll just, like, look like... i just get a bunch of press and look like a million bucks. Yeah. And then as he started winning, you're right, his ego does not allow him... It just caught fire because he gave a pretty out. dumb opening statement. Or a fairly, you know, poorly said opening statement. And it just resonated with people. Right. I, yeah, I don't think that anybody... When he first made the Mexican rapist thing... Right. That's his first speech. First. Yeah. To announce he was running for president. He's like, we're getting the rapists out of here. And people yeah. are like, well, this is like a joke, right? But everybody was like, no, 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 I'm voting for that guy. It's, so it became a different thing. Um, it's, yeah. it's I, said, I believe it's bringing more in. We should relieve Mexico of their problem. <laughs> of, of rapists? Bring yeah, in yeah, more rapists? In That's a terrible Absolutely. strategy. Why? 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 It's helpful. We're helpful. Helpful to Mexico? Is everyone. Oh. But why would it be helpful to us? Well, I mean, let's be good people. Get the rapists out of there, bring uh, them here. Are you planning a trip to Acapulco? <laughs> I just want it to be rape-free zone. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm actually on a vacation um, right below to Juarez. <laughs> <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> oh. Absolutely. That sounds, I mean, that should be, fun. That should be fun. <laughs> Sounds like it should be fun. Yeah, yeah. It's very tropical. I have this really hot blonde I'm going to take down to Juarez. Oh, perfect. Just walk around, meet some locals. <laughs> yeah, just walk Dance around in the, the streets. The open air market. Those perfect. Are fun. Yeah. Dancing um, in the clubs. Yeah. Get drunk. Yeah. Buy a round of drinks for everyone with yeah. cash. Fuck oh, yeah. good. And yeah. just put the remaining cash right back in your pocket, right? Yeah. Make sure, make sure you fuck with the guy with the, <laughs> the, the, the guitar case with guns in it. <laughs> I'll tell them, do you know who I am? I'm very important back home. Yeah. Say this. I may not have a lot of money, but my parents do. Well, yeah. that's not true. You should wear a shirt that says, I'm fired. <laughs> oh, you're fired from Donald Trump. Wear a Trump shirt, a Trump hat. Wear a Trump wig. Make America great again. Yeah. yeah. Make America great again. Donald uh, was on Wendy Williams in 2013. Oh. And this is the tape that came out yesterday. Oh, no. You know, you were talking about people... Talking about Donald Trump being kind of a sexual predator or not. And look, if he force kisses women, which he very well might do, because he's mentioned it a lot, yeah, right. that's not good. You can't force kiss women. What, what about force kissing men? Force kissing men, it's a sign of, of, of dominance and intimidation. Right, right. It's, that's okay. Yeah, Straighten them out. Yeah, straight. I'm the, I'm the alpha in this room. Right. I'm sure in a business scenario, huh. Huh. Donald has grabbed somebody by his two fat huh. cheeks on his face and kissed him right on the mouth right. and let him Plant know. Plant one. Yeah. yeah. Plant a smooch right here. Right. <laughs> but you can't do it to a woman. Um, he was on Wendy Williams, though, and Wendy asked him, I'm going to let you guess, Bobby, because Jim has seen the clip. Wendy had Ivanka and Donald on at the same time. Yeah. And he said, what do you two... Do you have the question? Do you have the question or no? The, well, I don't, you, do you want to just play the question? Can you do that, Adrian, and pause it? Yeah, yeah. All right, don't you fuck this up, Adrian. Don't you fuck this up. But you talk to him like that. That's oh, important. It's important. He was with me first. I know, but he needs to be disciplined. No, he doesn't. Is it, was he because let me first? tell you something. He came from, you know what, dude? Yeah. With a severe lack of discipline and respect. Well, because he wasn't there long enough before you sucked him out. First of all, he was interning for us before you. But go on. Break the fucking, is this the game we're playing? <laughs> fucking reality. <laughs> fucking fantasy. Yeah, yeah, fucking just reality fun. quick. <laughs> yeah, well, well, the mayor of a fun city just kind of crapped out. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? 
<laughs> let's listen. Let's listen to this question from yeah. our our guy. Yeah, Adrian. We want to know a little bit more about you guys, so we play this game here. It's called Fave Five. I'll ask the question. Uh, Ivanka, you answer first, and then Dad, you, you answer, answer also. Okay, Ivanka, <laughs> what's the favorite thing you have in common with your father? Either real estate or golf. Okay. Well, now we got to ask Trump. Well, it's the same question. Does she ask him? Or I think he just, she just throws it right to Trump. It's either real estate or golf. What is your favorite thing that you have in common with your father. And she Trump, says, Trump said, so we That doesn't even make any sense. <laughs> Why would you say that? <laughs> he just wanted to hit the button. This is what happened. See, you like the sound bites because they've been in context yeah. since you've been here, Bob. Yeah. But almost every day, they're not in context at all. They he just so hits in him. context. He just likes to. You're not so smart now, are you? <laughs> I was in context. He just finds excuses to push the buttons. <laughs> I can't, it's kind of addicting, like Hillary's vagina smell. That's right. <laughs> yeah, it's not good, but there's something about it. You keep going back. Yeah. What do you think, Bobby? Was uh, the thing for ten thousand dollars? What yeah. is the thing that Donald and Ivanka have in common that is Donald's favorite? Uh, um, <laughs> for, force kissing women. You think for you think Ivanka force kisses yes, women as she, well? I think she kiss, force kisses women. And uh, bl- and uh, light blonde pubic hair. <laughs> so you think Donald will say, "Well, it's our pubic hair. It's yeah. the same." Yes, it's it. Yes. Okay. Well, let's I think see. Pubic hair and uh, taking and- long, unbroken dumps. <laughs> okay. <laughs> long. Sh- they yeah. run in the Trump family. Yes, long, right. unbroken. A, a long, unbroken dump. It yeah, comes she's out a like. Bowl claw. Oh, that's Clinton. <laughs> <laughs> <Oops>. <laughs> Comes out like soft serve, just in that nice, even yeah. spiral. Is yeah. that right? Or I like one like a submarine. It just sinks. Oh, right, it goes down the pipe. It just goes down the pipe and half of it's sticking up. <laughs> you, don't know, you don't know how long it is. Right, right. You know, you pull it out and it's, it looks like looks like it's six inches. But if you get a little hook on it, <laughs> you don't need to pull a it thumb out. and an index and pull it out, <laughs> sure. it's around a 12-foot log. <laughs> You're not supposed to pull it out. Oh, all right. Well, I, I need to know. examine them. I, how are you going to see how long it is? No, would you, want, you wouldn't want someone to drop that in your mouth? And what? Then, and then it would slowly... <laughs> And then it would, it would stand up and uh, then would just uh, tip gently on the side of your face. <laughs> <laughs> what if a log falls on your face in the woods? Does it make a sound? No, you do. <laughs> it would just stick up and then the slowly the gravity would pull it over on your dude, cheek. I don't like the detail in no. what you're telling. I, you know what I'm saying? I don't like the fucking, the, the little tiny details that you're adding to the story. Yeah. <laughs> you never know. I mean, that no. would never, right? Like a log sticking. Oh. <laughs> Let's get back on topic here. What yeah. do you do with a log when you put it in your mouth? <laughs> <laughs> I imagine does you feel like skim- a, I imagine you feel like a goose. Do, does it you think so? <laughs> but you feel it, a little silly. But does it skim your teeth? <laughs> oh God, damn it! Or do you just do you have to put your lips around your teeth so you don't skim it? <laughs> <laughs> Is there a technique to eating shit? <laughs> like you know what I mean? Is oh. there a technique to putting a log in your mouth? You know, so bad. Language, language. Thank this you. is my house. Oh, sorry. Thank you. I'm oh, glad. I'm glad you did that. Should we find out what the thing that Ivanka and Donald have yes. in common that yeah. they that Donald likes the most? I say uh, the same color pubic hair. Uh huh. And long like a, shits. Like a toe head. Can I guess? And long, unbroken poops. Now we'll remind everybody. Ivanka's. She said golf and real estate. Yes. Like chip, if you want to guess, you can feel free. Probably playing uh, fucking Monopolies or something, because that motherfucker collecting boardwalk and park place and all that shit in it. I hate him. <laughs> it's just unnecessary. <laughs> I wish Sirius would fire him. <laughs> yeah, me too. Can we just fire Chip? Is just that possible? Chip. Is there any way we can fire Chip? <laughs> Get Chip banned from the building? <laughs> all right, let's find out what Donald uh, likes so much. Donald, with your daughter? Well, I was going to say sex, but I can't relate that. <laughs> what the fuck? Doesn't even. It's not. Money. He was just trying to. He jammed a joke in. That's all it was. Yeah, it's like a, it's one of the Twitter trolls just trying to jam a fat joke. I was going to say sex. <laughs> yeah, that's crazy. Isn't that a little creepy? Yeah. yeah. yeah well, it's not even. It's understandable. He's. Yeah. Do you think he wants to have sex with his daughter? 
I, I don't know. I mean, no. I think he just. I think that he sees her as an extension of how awesome he is because he created such a beautiful, tall woman. Yeah. And he's sitting there going, like, how great would she be to fuck? Because he knows how great he is to fuck. Well, meaning, like, look, look at what I created. This, this amazing piece of ass. Didn't he once say that if they weren't related, he'd be dating her? He, he said, said that multiple on, on the times. View, yes. On the View, he said that they made fun of him. But yeah. It was actually a likable clip of him on the View. It wasn't likable at all. No, because he was like legitimately <laughs> laughing when they made fun of him, calling him Woody Allen. Like he, they got him and he laughed about it. It was funny. Yeah, but it wasn't likable. They were making fun of him because he just said he would date his daughter. If they, like, hey, he's <laughs> I'm the president. This is uh, this is a great. The title of this YouTube video is Donald Trump uh, nearly casually remarks about incest with his daughter. But what would you do, Playboy Look at her legs on the cover. Of the magazine, and she had not. This is going to be an interesting answer. <laughs> <laughs> she, he doesn't even want you to have a drink. I know it. So. It would be really disappointing. Not really. But it would depend what? on what was inside the magazine. Oh. If, no, if oh. she posed, it would be fine. But if they put her picture yeah, on. Yeah, but it depends on what goes inside the magazine. Well, see, that's her magazine. gripe. That's right. this girl's gripe. And, mm -hmm. and People assume nothing. there'll be nude, nude photos. Right, you do assume Misleading. that with Playboy. Okay, she, but if there weren't, Playboy you wouldn't have an issue with it then. If they were using her to... I don't think Ivanka would do that inside the magazine, although she does have a very nice figure. I've said right. that if Ivanka weren't my daughter, perhaps I'd be dating her. You know? Stop <laughs> it! Oh, it's what? so weird! Stop You know it. what? You are moving sick! Up. Yeah. Know, yeah, dude, listen. Yeah. Isn't it terrible? That's, uh, yeah. that's not a boys will be boys I, I, moment, I, I, and that's not like him. He's likeable. just laughing. He's just... Yeah. He's almost... Like, he's almost mm. Aspergery. Yeah. He's yeah. almost Aspergery. Mm -hmm. Like, but, but watch when they get... He's just laughing and having a good time with it. That's, that's not... But that's not... That's not something to have a good time with. Yeah, but no, because you have to have that thought by yourself. Yeah. To, to, to make that joke. You, Even, have to, you have to have every, I believe every joke lies in a, like there's a lot of little tiny truth to it. You had that thought. Right. And you'll go, oh, that's funny. Right. You know what I mean? But you have to understand what the truth of that would be yeah. to understand that it's funny. Yeah. Like the moment that he says, but you know, let's be honest, she does have a good figure. Immediately you go, what? Like, no, did that's, he a, that's something that you would say about no. you. Okay, you can say my daughter. How many Look, mothers my... say that? My son is so handsome. When they're like, he's going to pose oh. nude, and they're like, oh, he's got a beautiful body. You'd be like, what the fuck? Nah, but yeah, I, I know what you mean. Look, but, I, but there's a difference between a little kid. Like, Max has a nice little tush. I'd like to take a little bite once in a while, just a little bite of Max's bum. Does he got any <laughs> friends you could bring along? <laughs> <laughs> I knew he'd come out. Yeah. He's going to lure him out with some... Little but, little yeah. boy tush candy. Yeah, hey, you can't leave them kind of breadcrumbs laying around. <laughs> but look it, you look it, you can't. <laughs> it's like, look when you're talking about it's it's a different. I when you're talking about a little kid and he's cute or yeah. she's gorgeous, you're not talking sex. There's no sex, right? That's you, sex. Why not? Once you, once you have pubes, <laughs> yeah, yeah, boo. and you're talking about. <laughs> Yank him out with tweezers. Uh, Forever yeah. young. Uh, yuck. <laughs> it's just the worst. You love that song? Look yes, at little, I do. Little, little bums. I love Peter Pan. Up. Can we not do this? Can we take but yes, Oh, off? I got that picture Shut. in my restaurant. Uh, the three heinies, I call it. It's awful. Eeny, meeny, miny. Uh, uh, uh. We know who's never going to run for president. <laughs> we know Norton's never going to have an office. Look at those three. Gonna, Eeny, play, meeny, miny. Uh, uh, this, this is all they have to play for to, to get Norton out of the game if he's running for president. <laughs> <laughs> I said things in nineteen in, in, in May of 1990. Tefbox, were we see you on the hotline? Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt okay. you. It's just the hotline. No, 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 I uh, we, it's uh, the, the tef teftification of the U.S. of A. is happening. Yeah, yeah. But you're right about the Donald thing. That, like, there's something about the way he says it. Yeah. That, like, if you were in a room, you'd be like, yeah, isn't my daughter fucking sexy? Like, I'm just appreciating my daughter. But your daughter's too old to say that. You're too, you guys are adults, and she is smoking hot. I mean, it's like. Are you but you're the guy, like, it should be like, oh, we can't say she's hot and her dad's here. Uh, yeah, that's that's true. You know, that's, what you're, that's how it's supposed to go. It's weird. Right? It yeah. is a little weird. I, especially when he's like, we both like sex. You know, I often, and he said, I've often joked. If I wasn't Ivanka's father, I'd probably be dating yeah, her. Yeah, because like, we her legs are phenomenal. Yeah, but if... <laughs> dude, she's amazing. She's amazing. That You can't... If you I date her, when you say you're... When you're Donald Trump and you say you date a girl, you're fucking them. Yeah, first like night. You're, you're fucking them. Donald wow. doesn't just date you, you know, oh, I'd take her out to dinner and walk her to her car and kiss her on the cheek. I'm going to finger fuck you in my limo. Yes. Is what you're basically... He's not a gentleman on the first date. You have to go further with that thought. That's true. He's really not... Yeah. <laughs> the animals of his dates, he has to go, could you jump up and down so my watch falls out? 
<laughs> wow, she has nice feet too. Yeah, she's beautiful. But just even to like, you think he's ever rubbed her feet? I Who? think he has. Cutting a rod, I would. I, I believe he's rubbed her feet. Why not? Oh, she's beautiful. I believe he's, he's offered his daughter a foot massage like after a tough day at work. Yes, yeah, I believe yeah. that has happened. I don't think he's jerked off to it, Adrian. But I, I bet, I bet there was there was something going on down there. She is really stunning. What's her husband like? Is he like some big business guy? No, he's just an average dude. I think he's probably yeah. Oh, okay. She's beautiful. Yeah. Oh, he's definitely average. Jared Kushner. Yeah, he's probably comes oh, from. He's got dimples. She is gorgeous. I sat behind her at a press conference once, yeah. and that was enough. Mm. It was enough. She's amazing. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh she, la la. I smelled her ponytail. Ew. Smelled it's, good. Did you really? It, yes. It's all her. Think she got mother, a whiff of though. your hair? He's an investment guy. Yeah. No, I don't think she got a whiff of my hair. Why? I'm just wondering. No, I don't think she said I was behind her. It smells like Jerry Curl. <laughs> Put Jerry Curl in my hair. Does. Let your Some soul. Oil. Your hair smells like your hair smells like fucking uh, yeah. like uh, cocoa butter. Yeah. Oil. He got off the street in front. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Front <laughs> of the basketball courts. Huh? That smells like On Egyptian six. musk. <laughs> 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 That's it. Let's go to. Uh, Chris in Chicago. You want to call Jim Norton and Sam Roberts this morning? It's 866-969-1969. You can follow us on Twitter at Jim and Sam Show. Oh, he owns the New York Observer. And Robert Kelly is here. Uh, Good what's morning, going guys. on, Chris? Well, you know, if you listen back to that clip that he just played... Uh, Which one, the view clip or the or the one where the he goes... Which one are you yeah. talking about? <laughs> the what's view the motherfucking clip? clip? I was the fucking clip. There's a lot of them. Uh, Get off he, he didn't phone. say that... He doesn't say it off the cuff. That was pre-planned, how he said that, well, I would date my daughter. He, he had that thought in his head yeah. way before that question came out. That's his line, you know what I mean? He's like, that, that's how he makes uh, other people know that he's the man. He's like, you see how, how hot my daughter is? I would bang her if she wasn't my daughter. Yeah, but nobody's if around. You had that kind of, sorry. I'm sorry, guys. If you had that kind of comment, wouldn't that be something you just like, oh, say it off the cuff? But he's had that in his you know, arsenal. Yeah, he has. Yeah, yeah, I would have been like, yo, that bitch so fine, she looks thin and shit. <laughs> What's up? Why'd you have to hit the, see, <laughs> he hits the button, that even though it's, that's him, his button. Shit, dip. Get off me, Edgar. It's, it's his, the chip <laughs> laugh is now. I Edgar's a, fucking dumb baby fingernails. The chip laugh is now a button. A button? Yes. Where are you from? It's, Harry Potter? It's a Emerald? button. He's the mayor of <laughs> It's just magic. It's a button. <laughs> hey, let me ask you, that camera you had, off subject for one second, that camera you had at the comedy show, you know, is good. Is that order, or can I buy that in a store? You, can, um, you can't buy it in a store. You have to order it. It's called the uh, Mevo. Okay. And you have one in oh, the studio. I've... You have one here. You can just take that one. They don't use it. Yeah, there's a Mevo here. Yeah, there's a really? Mevo here. Just take that one. Use oh, it. Oh, whip it good. ba na 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 Mevo. 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 Yeah. They have it, uh, yeah, uh, Edgar, if you, I swear to God, I'm going to bite your fingernails clean. Shit, dip. I hate his dry mouth. Yeah, they brought him in here, but the uh, the resolution's not as good as those, but it'd be good for sets or whatever. I might want to do it because they might, my, my, I, I need to shoot myself to show my uh, person. Are you going to shoot your special on him? Yes, I'm going to hand hold one in front of me and just look into it. <laughs> Mevo, Uvo, we all go. Uh... Let's go to Frank yeah. in Jersey. What's up, Frank? <laughs> hey, what's going on, guy? Hey, East Brunswick here representing uh, Jim from North Brunswick. Listen to me. Uh, the funny thing is about Trump's what? daughter's... Uh, uh, what? Yeah, Trump's, uh, no, uh, East Brunswick. You're from North Brunswick, Jimmy, right? Shut the fuck up! <laughs> <laughs> hey, listen. Uh, Trump's daughter's husband was put in jail by Chris Christie. Trump's daughter's husband's father, rather... Is a crooked politician, money laundering and whatnot, and he was put he was put in jail for fifteen years by Chris Christie, which is ironic because Chris Christie is supporting Trump. Oh wow! Oh. Yeah. maybe that's why uh, he didn't become the VP because he put his Trump son-in-law in jail, technically, or the father, the brother, the son-in-law, whatever the fuck relationship that is. He didn't become the VP because I mean, maybe that went into it though. That was fat fat guys. Fucking, he's a fucking goon. Trump has gotten chubby, hasn't he? Yes, he has. he's back to when he was in when he fought in WWE. Fat. <laughs> right. Remember when he right. when he fell? Just a terrible bump. He was who was he beating? Oh, was he beating up McMahon? Vince. Vince. He went and to he, clothesline him, and his whole body just fell over. Yeah, but remember his ass? Remember how big his ass yep. was? It looked like a, like a fat woman ass. Yeah. 
Oh. Yeah, it just jiggled on the way down. We watch him when we watch the debates in here. Yeah. You can see that it, it's such a wide ass he's got. Well, <laughs> yeah, he, he has a big, comfortable chair, Heidi. He does. Mm, yeah. He does. That's meant for a throne. He did. He, <laughs> had, he really does have fucking. Uh... Oh, no, go back to the beginning. You want to oh. see athleticism, Jim? Look at uh, look at Trump's big bump. Look at. <laughs> oh, but look at that ass. Look, look. Look, look at it portraying. They film it in a way that it looks like he's punching him. He was punching him. He oh, was. He was really hitting him. Why is he wearing a suit in wrestling? It was the Battle of the Billionaires, Jim. Yeah, Battle of the Billionaires. You have to wear a suit. Can't be a billionaire and not have a suit. Oh, my God. Where'd my cheese go, DDT? <laughs> That's not the lyrics to the song, dude. God damn it. That's not the lyrics to the song at all. Ah. What's One, wrong? One, two, three. Where did cheese go? <laughs> you like this, Bobby? Where did cheese go? I don't know. Tep Box is moving in there right now. I love this. How long will it last? Where did cheese go? I don't know. You know, people keep asking us to play the profane version of that song. I don't want to. I didn't know there was one to be honest. There is. There's a part two. I don't need to use that kind of language with profanity, and I don't. I don't. I don't necessarily want to. No, just part one. I think we're good with the with what we got. But yeah, so. uh... Donald is uh, there. There's yeah. some. There's some. There's some weirdness. It is some weirdness. Yeah. Some weird, and he has that weird white guy, like Mason, <laughs> creepiness about that, him. That yeah. The you know just, just that naked. If you saw him naked, you just be like, what is he? Male, female? <laughs> uh, yeah, you know what I've I mean, been, I've been there. <laughs> <laughs> Look at this photo of him. I've seen this a bunch of times. Oh my God, it's Ivanka when she's like, how old did you say? Thirteen, fourteen, maybe. Yeah, and she, she's, she, her face looks very young, but she's tall, so she looks older. But her face looks really young. She's sitting on Donald's lap, yeah, and or she's sitting on his knee, and Donald's got his hand on her hip, and she's got her, she's cupping oh. his face. Well, where is he supposed to put it? It's just such yeah, a creepy I mean, photo. It, it really isn't. It, 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 it seems inappropriate. Yeah. Don't you think because her it's a too loving a look? Her cupping his face and looking at him longingly. Well, that, that might she be just idolizes him. Like, can I just say something though? Sure. Photog- for, thank you. <laughs> photographers sometimes get carried away. Yeah. I mean, me and Don, we got married in Maui. We we're, were on the beach. Yeah. And after the, you know, we're doing our photo shoot after we got married. And they kept telling us to do, go do this, do that. Oh, go on the tree. Like, go in the water. All of a sudden, we're in the water. She's like, oh, pick her dress and up. And you're just listening to him because you, yeah. be- you, you believe, you hired him, you believe yeah. him, you yeah. trust him. Yeah. I was like, I'm, honey, the lady just told me to pull your dress up. <laughs> like, I'm not pulling my wife's dress. What are you, nuts? Yeah, Why not? What's our wedding day, you fucking it's weirdo? Get that coda showing. <laughs> that's what hot pictures are made of. It's uh, <laughs> a terrible idea. It's, yeah, but we were, I don't, I, like, I started, I have one photo of us in the water. And I'm pulling up her leg, yeah, and she's like, "Yeah, fuck pull, yeah, pull it up." Like she was uh, get naked. Fuck mm-hmm. yeah, not me, of course. <laughs> Dog. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, no. Fuck no. yeah. Yeah. And then no... we we ruined her fucking dress. Oh like yeah, got come, come on it and shit. No, no. We didn't get come on it, Chip. You're totally <laughs> on the wrong, wrong direction here. I got married. You don't fuck on your wedding night. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have sex anyway? I guess you do, right? Yeah, you have to. You, do. you have to. Yes. Yeah. I remember I would carried her in, and I hit. You know the hotel doors mm-hmm. in the movies? They just kick them open and they stay open. Yeah. In bond. real life, in real life, they fucking swing shut. <laughs> <laughs> Smacked her in the head. <laughs> really? Uh, yeah. I, I, I kicked the door open and we were going in and the door just whacked her in the fucking head. <laughs> that way you get there. Lucky she ain't got killed as shit. Why would she get killed by a hotel door? Uh, every character stinks. <laughs> the worst. They're just they're the worst. They're the yeah, worst. They're fucking literally just <laughs> screeching halt. <laughs> terrible. <laughs> just <laughs> fucking terrible. <laughs> <laughs> There's like fucking eight people going. Ha ha ha. Everybody, everybody else is turning the radio off. Yup. Yeah, <laughs> just <laughs> going back to sports talk. They are. <laughs> ah, so the Cubs won last night. Shit, dude. Oh, I hate them. <laughs> Kate Edgar out of all of them. Yeah, the Cubbies. Uh, like what did I say yesterday. Cubby scalp the tribe. I said that. You didn't say that. You just made it up just you now. Can't, you can't say that. Cubby scalped the tribe that's five that, uh, one. That's, Speaking that's, of the Cubbies, I do want to see the Cubs win though, because uh, but then again, the Indians haven't won in fucking sixty years. Fuck either. the Indians. They won. They just oh. won basketball. This, they just got Cleveland. Fuck that. Oh. Dude, they, they like just Steve won the Miocic. championship. So I want to see them win. You do. No, you know, I like the Cubbies too because I like Chicago. Stop saying not. You keep saying I want to see them win, and I go, you do, and you go, nah. But I also like, like, yeah, who but cares? I'm, I'm big on Chicago. I do my Chicago accent this thing. Is, it's a big this hit. is Flip Flop Frank. You ever met him? Wait, wait, wait. 
You know how to do a Chicago accent? I've never heard yeah. that. Hey, yeah. the darn Cubbies are in the old series area. They're, they might win the ball game. Travis, you're a baseball guy, right? Yeah. Does anybody call the World Series the old series? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, hey, look, the Cubbies are in there. Looks like they're going to hit a bunch of home runs. What is that? Yeah, I mean, probably. Where, what, what dialect is that? It's from Chicago. What? What part of Chicago? All over. The whole thing. Sure. That's not what they sound like in yeah, anywhere yeah, in Chicago. Hey, Rob Blagojevich. <laughs> <laughs> no, that, okay. That is authentic. It sounds hey. like a, f- it could be like anywhere. No, it's not. Yeah, it could be Pittsburgh. I yeah. sound like Sebastian. He has a heavy Chicago Who? accent. Sebastian Maniscalco is a comedian. No, he doesn't sound he like, does. he sounds like an Italian. Hey, I'm over there in a deep dish he does, Number one, score a bunch of homers. He doesn't sound like doesn't that. Sound and like number that two, he doesn't have a very Chicago accent. It's, he does, there's, actually. There's hints of it. No, it's heavy. Will you hear him talk? I went to Kmart. Like he, has, <laughs> he has a fucking a Chicago bury you in cement accent. <laughs> if, he wasn't, if, he, if he wasn't a comic, I would think that he was a fucking gangster. Uh, let's go to Scott in Chicago. What's going on, Scott? Oh, nothing much, man. Love Scotty! Hey, Jimmy! Hey, buddy. <laughs> hey, hey, your, and your, his, his Chicago impression is spot on. Thank you. It's, Spot on. Oh, spot on. Um, it's so good, you'd think there was like a whole deep dish pizza thing. Yeah. Okay, Cubbies are in a series. You talk, the Chicago, People from Chicago don't just sit around talking about deep dish all the time. Hey, hey, hey. If I want my prick gold, I'll do it myself. Can, can, okay. we, can we just say deep dish pizza stinks? I hey, agree with you, Chicago Bob. pizza. It's a Chicago tree. Fucking <laughs> stinks. Don't you knock Chicago. I'll, I'll Capone you. Oh, Chicago. Al Capone. Chicago has great food. <laughs> Unbelievable food. One of the best food cities Have out there. Have a little deep dish pizza over there. <laughs> 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 Fucking sticks. Chicago pizzas. You should be ashamed yeah, you of yourself. Don't say that. The Cubbies are playing ball in the uh, old series. I love Bobby trying to make a point in Chicago gym. <laughs> Coming in and not, I like like, it. not allowing I like it. it to happen. I like it. Yeah. Hey, shit up over Get there. <laughs> Chicago I Edgar. Your Get your fingers off. I'm Edgar Blagojevich. <laughs> what? I can't wait till the day that Jim just short circuits and just all the characters oh. come out at once. I can't wait till somebody puts him in a home. Yeah, just like a straight jacket. Like who's who's the who's the guy who's doing yeah, the impressions? You, deep dish. you know all the impression guys. You know fucking what? are either dead or in an insane asylum. Here's what's gonna be great. He's gonna short circuit. Yeah. All of his characters yeah. are gonna come out at once. Yeah. Then. He's yeah. just going to stop responding. His brain his brain and body will no longer be connected. Yeah. I will wheel him in here in a wheelchair yeah. every morning and, and to do the show. And I'll just go, so we! <laughs> God damn you. <laughs> Why would you say that if you had couldn't? Go on, Scott. I, I just no wanted sense. to admonish everybody in Chicago for not coming out and seeing Bobby Kelly when he was in town a couple of weeks ago. He was awesome. Thank you, buddy. You're great. Thank I, you. I was the first guy to take a picture with you, and I told you I brought my wife with, and I've been in trouble ever since because she's like, he did a lot of cum stuff. It was <laughs> yeah. really cool. You do a lot of cum but jokes? It was hilarious to me. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I fucking <laughs> yeah. laughed my ass off. I, I, I was so yeah. happy to see you, man. Please come back. Oh, get all of you guys to come to Chicago. I feel like, you know, Jimmy comes once every year and two years, and we, we should do a radio more. show in Chicago. Yeah. <laughs> Stop doing so much cum stuff. Yeah. I would love to. We yeah, should exactly. go to Chicago. Hopefully, we'll have uh, people come uh, yeah. to see. Guys, oh, enough would... with the cum. Yeah, nah, you uh, ain't I did lying. <laughs> nah, you ain't lying. Uh, you're I, do have, I do have like 20 minutes of jizz. <laughs> I literally look, My new hour is like, I just call it jizz. <laughs> you're dirty. It's, uh, okay. it's, Clean it's up a lot your of uh, <laughs> okay. It's a lot of jizz. <laughs>